Hello everyone, welcome back. We are doing more Assassin's Creed 2 today. In the last episode, we delivered a letter. In this episode, we're going to do some more menial tasks. Let's talk to our mother, or our sister. Hey Claudia, how are you? Bene. You shouldn't keep things from me. It's Duccio. What of him? I think he's been unfaithful. Who told you this? The other girls. I mean, they could also be jealous, friends. but... Harpies. You're better off without them. I loved him. No, Claudia. You only thought you did. He should suffer for what he's done. Wait here. I'll go have a word with him. We're just gonna have, you know, rumor and innuendo guide our things, but that's okay. We're gonna go beat him up. Let's do it. Alright, so let's uh let's go this way this time, see what we can uh come up with. I think, if you look at the map, we're going to actually hit a uh, viewpoint on the way, so I'm going to head up first. Have you been drinking? Oh, oh, okay, we're good, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Oh, that's a tall tower, oh boy. Uh, will I be able to even do that one? That's a good question. So let's uh let's let's give it a shot. Something tells me that I'm not going to be able to do this right away. But let's go up this building first. This seems to have a little bit easier of a climbing method than the uh Okay, I can't go higher. Go all the way to the left, Etio. Keep going. Climb up. Oh, okay, we're gonna go down a smidge, then to the left. So you kind of have to think, okay, how can I climb up this more effectively? You can't always just go straight left or right. You have to sometimes go uh, down to go left or right or whatever. So just keep that in mind. Now, thankfully, we're actually making some good progress. I don't think we can go up further here. I think we have to go around the side. And I I could not tell you how much money it would take for me to be able to, to do something like this. Not that I would pay to do it, but someone would have to uh, pay me in order to, for me to do this. Because I don't trust myself to climb all this and not fall to a catastrophic death. Because we're still going. We're still going up. And I think we actually should be able to just go straight all the way to the top from here. Um, maybe some minor left or right adjustments, but generally speaking, we should be should be good. And then oh god, then there's the uh, the jump backwards to grab something. Absolute, absolutely no, no way, nope, uh, uh never happening. But we do get a really good view of up here. So that is cool. Um, now I think there are chests down there, but I don't think it's worth going down there. Instead, I think it's more worth being able to jump and doing the leap of faith from all the way up here. Because that would kill us. That would 100% kill us. No, 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 you don't see me. You don't know that I'm here. Stay back. Don't look in the hay bale. Sorry, get out of here. That guy literally just spawned in. Cool. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go talk to Duccio. Where is he? He's over here. Duccio, it's a beautiful. Nothing but the best for you. Amore mio. But what of Claudia? I thought you'd been promised to her. The father said I could do much better than an auditore. Wow, he even wears his hat like an asshole. Birbante. Come, let us walk a bit. Walk? I had something else in mind. Oh, Duccio. Mm. Yeah, and character animations were not great at this point in time. Hey, 
It will be seen. It, will, it has to be said. Ezio, my friend. Ah, oh, good pizza. job. You insult my sister. Parading around with this puttana. Well, what are you talking about? I saw the gift you gave her. Or the things you said. Maybe your sister shouldn't be so stingy with her virtu. You broke her heart. Ha! And now I'm going to break your face. Okay. <laughs> you auditore is all top -fee. But when it comes time for action, ha! you regret ever opening your mouth. I could I mean, we can just sister, a great mash the square sister. button. She's lucky to have had someone like me. Bastardo! Easy peasy. Bastardo. Yeah, I bet you yield. Stay away from my sister! Done. One more for good measure. All right, so let's see. We should be able to just go on back now and talk to... Actually, I don't think we have to talk to Claudio. We can just either talk to our brother or our mother. Uh, I'm going to actually detour and get this last viewpoint that's over here very quickly. Because it's relatively close. It's not, like, strictly on the way, but... It, uh... It is relatively close, and we don't have to go too bad, too far, um, to get there. So let's uh, let's see. Let's actually go all the way around over this way, and we'll use this part of the rooftop in order to climb up a little bit more efficiently. And that's actually going to be one of the big. Uh, I'm not going to call it concerns, but something you got if you guys want to play this game as well if you have not played Assassin's Creed 2 fix that immediately first of all second of all uh you have to think how you can get from point A to point B effectively and efficiently you don't want to be um uh waiting around and trying to oh can't go that way let's go up this way Nope, gotta go in the middle of the door. There we go. Uh, in order, you, like, you can't go straight up a lot of the time. You have to go around left or right um, in order to get to the top of whatever tower or whatever area you're climbing. So you just gotta think, how can I do this in a way that makes sense um, and isn't going to cause more burden than it really needs to be? Because sometimes climbing things, you can do it multiple ways, but some ways are easier than others. So, let's synchronize here. We got another pretty tall tower um, that we're a part of. This is actually the prison, I believe. Um, so, we'll be able to see quite a bit. And we'll be coming back here later. But uh, I do want to get over this way. Because we have a codex page. Alright, so we just, thankfully, because we all, we do not have weapons, they don't have weapons, which is nice, but we can counter them pretty easily, so just keep wailing on them. Oh, right in the throat. Kick him in the knee. Oh, we are almost dead. So, some guards are a little bit more strong than others. A little stronger than others, I should say. And they can counter as well. So, we have to be careful and not just spam an attack because otherwise they will counter us, and that is not good. But we came in here for this chest, which we're going to see scattered throughout the game. And it's a codex page. We will need these every now and again. Um, and we will need those actually quite late, uh, quite a bit later um, in order to do some... Uh... Oh, we got throwing knives. Cool, okay. Uh, how do I get to my throwing knives? Left is using the actual medicine. So I wasted the medicine, but that's okay. Uh, how do I get? Oh, holding R1. That's how. 
So I can I can use medicine, I can throw some florins, or I can use my fists. I don't have the ability to use my throwing knives as of yet. Which does make sense. We can't just go around murdering people. Not a good look for us. But uh, not much we can do otherwise. So let's see. Pouches. We don't have enough for any of that. Uh, either the large or medium medicine pouches, which is a couple thousand florins. Um, instead, we're going to go this way, and we're going to hopefully not interact with the... There we go, let's kind of skirt past them. There we go. And we'll go to our, our house over this way. Oh man, such a good game. There's so... it, it feels so alive. Who's this? Is this a courier mission? I think this is a courier mission. I turned them off because um, I couldn't be bothered with courier missions. I don't want to just take have missions that make me go from one place to another. Um, I'll probably do them off screen if anything, um, but I probably won't do them at all because I couldn't really bother. Um, all it really does is give you some florins. In some cases, it gives you some extra stuff, but nothing too significant. Um, so let's talk to our brother first what are you doing out here petruccio you should be in bed i want those feathers what for it's a secret if i get them for you when you go back inside yes, i don't know I what promise. time of day it is so i don't know why he, he, Ezio is saying he should be in bed but uh whatever let's um let's get some feathers we gotta get three feathers in a mi uh two and a half minutes So we got one, we got two more that we can uh, get. And they're, they're relatively easy to get to, thankfully. Um, fairly straightforward paths in order to get to them. Um, and we even have a synchronization point here that we're going to take advantage of while we're in the area. Um, and this one's not super tall, so it's uh, it's fairly quick, and we can just do it as a part of the the mission. Um, and as you can see, some areas of the of the city we're not able to get to yet. So these uh, synchronization markers will be very oh, ow, will be very useful, but uh, we won't need them right now. All right, and there we go, feather acquired. So all we gotta do is bring it back to Petruccio. Um, let's see, where, do, should we just drop down through here? Can't blend in with that crowd, that's fine. We're just going to skirt past you guys and run inside. There we are. And we always knock when entering a building because we're polite. Here, as promised. Grazie, brother. You still haven't told me why you want these. I will, in time. All right. Well, it'll be interesting to see what they're uh, what they're going to be used for. Um. All right. So, Petruccio's secret. It's done. Let's uh, talk to our mother, and finish off this third mission before we go any further with the story. Buongiorno, Ezio. Buongiorno a voi, madre. Come state? Sto bene. And you? Still recovering from last night? I have no idea what you're talking about. Of course not. Anyway, I have an errand to run. I'd like you to join me. Con piacere. Come. It's not far from here. All right, cool. So we get to run an errand with our mother, friend of the family. So let's uh, help her out and see where we're going with this. So we just got to follow her. She does have a health bar. We... We don't have to worry so much about um, her being attacked or anything like that. So, Let's not play this game. but in future escort missions, we will have to keep that in mind. Allow him to continue. I'm sure he's having a hard time dealing with the accusations against his father, Francesco Di Pazzi. Is many things, and none of them good. But even I never suspected he'd be capable of murder. Murder? What happened to him? I imagine there will be a trial. Will father speak at it? He'll have to. 
He's the one with the evidence. Oh, that's good. I wish there was another way. That's that's you totally not going to backfire on us in, a, in, in any way. Everyone wants justice done. It is an unfortunate state of affairs, but it will pass. Hey, that's the one that was with Duccio. That just walked by. Interesting. Okay. Also, I'm going to take this opportunity to loot real fast. It does say warning reduced distance to target, but she does slow down. And we can't run while inside, which is kind of annoying, but we can when we get back outside. So. Here we are. So let's see what this is. Who's this errand? What's this errand all about? Who's this person? Hello, Leonardo. Madonna Maria. Leonardo da Vinci. Ezio. Molto onorato. L'onore è mio. Let me go and fetch the paintings. I'll be right back. He's very talented. Imagino. Self-expression is vital to understanding and enjoying life. You should find an outlet. I have plenty of outlets. I meant besides vaginas. Mother. Okay. Back to your house then. Little little Please. blunt, but sure. Ezio, help Leonardo, will you? Oh yes, of course. Let me let me so pick Ezio, that up. What do you do? He's been working for his father. Ah. Do I just? Oh yeah. So I get to I get to run. Okay. So I get to kind of do a weird. Shuffle run esque Don't kind of thing. Told, it's been difficult for me to settle. Painting is nice, but I often feel like my work lacks, I don't know, a purpose. Does that make sense? I'd rather contribute more practically, more. All right, so I think we have to go. Oh, here we are. Okay. Or anatomy. I'm not content merely to capture the world. I want to change it. Oh, Leonardo, I have no doubt you'll go on to do great things. Even grazie, Madonna. I'm sure he will. Totally, totally normal, not not extraordinary things, right? Right? So, here we go. Let's drop this object here and finish the mission. Thank you for your help, son. Don't let me keep you from your other duties. It was nice to meet you, Ezio. I hope our paths cross again. Anchio. All right, cool. And now we can continue on with the next mission. However, we're instead going to end the episode there. Thank you all for watching. Uh, I appreciate uh, you all stopping by and checking this out. Uh, if you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like and a comment as what you enjoyed. If you dislike, please leave a dislike and what you did not enjoy so we can fix it for future. Um, again, I thank you all for watching. I appreciate it, each and every one of you. Um, if you have not subscribed, please subscribe. Um, I keep changing this outro because I remember some things and forget others, but whatever. So I thank you all for watching. I hope you have a good night. Good day. Good time of whatever. Doesn't matter. Have a good one.